just not quite there yet. Let's get those Magnum Don Perignon bottles lined up. I remember a few stories from back in the day. I can't go into detail, but those celebrations would sometimes last three days. Today, the drivers are so disciplined and hardworking. Just continue down on your left. There are some trash cans back there that need to be emptied. And just say it. Mr. Lee! Mr. Lee! One moment, please! Miss Lindsay LaCour, the famous American television personality. How nice to see you! Oh, you recognize me. That's... Uh, well... Anyway, uh, I was just wondering. We're setting up for a quick post-race interview. I just want to make sure you're okay with that after your podium moment. Anything for you, Miss LaCour. Wonderful. Man, what a loser. Thank you. Oh, and congratulations on the victory. Thank you, miss. I'll see you shortly. Down the passageway, Buddy you should find the podium. Saw the flamingo mascot backstage this morning. Turns out that before joining the Global Innovation Race, he was a mascot at the Prescott Frontiers Days, America's oldest rodeo. Yes, sir. We head hunted a real superstar mascot. Make sure to get Salutations. Howdy, partner. Hello, sir. Mr. Lee. Allow me to be the first to officially congratulate you on the well-deserved victory. Ah, Mr. Rudder, isn't it? Thank you very much. My pleasure. I must say, it was a joy to watch you crush the opposition like that. Very impressive. Anyway. All right, excellent. So, oh my god. Once you get the cue, you come up, I'll make a short announcement, and then you accept the trophy. Now, some people like to drink a bit. I don't know whether that is something you want to do. I can't really recommend it, in terms and all. But I'll leave that entirely up to you. Any questions? No, I think I get it. All right. See you up there in a moment. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Maxwell Rudder. I am the senior race official here at the Miami Global Innovation Race. The race is now officially over, and it's time to hand out the trophy to the winner. This year's winner proved that hard work and dedicated focus on quality wins over the flair of provocation and the allure of empty charm. With flawless technological execution and persistently excellent driving, this year's winner is undoubtedly the right one. So please join me in giving the fan favorite, Mr. Moses Lee of Calhoun Heavy Industries, a big hand. There's a slight delay, folks, but I'm sure we can expect the Global Innovation Race winners on the podium in a few seconds.